Namaskar. Welcome back to India. We are so relieved that you are back. We are also working on the other students from Odisha to return as soon as possible. Could you please relate some of your experiences? Thank you very much, sir. As we got the uh, the notification from the Odisha government on uh, 25th, 25th uh, February, uh, uh, so uh, we contacted uh, Ravi Khan, sir, on WhatsApp about our situation at uh, at Ukraine and about our evacuation plan. Uh, as sir, uh, most students are evacuating through the uh, uh, Romanian Ukrainian border. Uh, so, uh, uh, so uh, we uh, we uh, give all the information to Ravi Khan, sir, uh, through uh, through WhatsApp. And contacted him, and uh, and uh, after the crossing the Ukrainian border, uh, um, the the embassy officials received us at the Ukrainian border, and then they tra the travel us to Bucharest, the capital of uh, Romania, uh, which is 500 kilometers from uh, the the Romanian border. And at the night, we had a scheduled flight of Air India, and uh, we came to uh, um, New Delhi by the flight. Uh, from where the uh, Odisha uh, government uh, officials all received us and take us to the uh, the Odisha Bhavan, sir. Uh, we are now fine, sir, but worried about our friends. They they are stuck there, sir. We are working hard to see that they return to India as fast as possible. Thank you very much, sir. It's all all your compliments and uh, thank you very much, sir, for all your support. It's it's really help help us all all the students, sir. There. Do you have any suggestions? by which we can improve this evacuation process because you are all experienced from that place. If you have any suggestions, please uh, share. Yes, sir. Sir, we all students are from the western Ukrainian border. So, it's less war, war zone area. But mostly Odia students are stuck in the Kharkiv region. And uh, and mostly Odia students are stuck there. And due to their, uh, there is the war situation going on, uh, they, they are only living in the shelter. They are unable to go outside also. So uh, it's it's really very important for as a Odia students to evacuate all the Odisha students from the uh, from there because mostly Odia students are residing in Kharkiv region, sir. So uh, it's very dangerous uh, uh, for them as they are not getting outside also, no transportation also, and there is a live war going on, sir. So they they have lack of food or shelter. They are only residing in the in the shelter home. And no, there is no food, no blanket. The temperature is going down, and and uh, their health also de deteriorating, sir. So uh, it's uh, worrisome, sir. So uh, I've already spoken to the Home Minister and to the External Affairs Minister to help us as much as possible. I'll speak to them again. I'm glad that you have returned. We are doing our utmost for the rest of our people in the Ukraine and will continue to do so. Sir, uh, I really thank you for evacuating us and saving our life. Uh, sir, my request is, sir, uh, we are from actually eastern part, but my request is, sir, please save the, our brother's life from western part who is stuck in there. And uh, I uh, uh, request you to, sir, give all the transportation system to reach the border and please tell the embassy of the all the borders of the Poland, Romania or Swiss Re Republic to uh, release them uh, immediately from the border, sir. My request is, sir, please tell the embassy uh, to uh, relieve them from in, near the border. All right, I'll do that. Thank you, sir, very much, sir, for sir, supporting us. We'll continue to do so. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir.